actually, you know, I didn't know what I was doing with this uh, originally, and that's why I changed the words. And now I'm really kind of happy with where they are now. It's been 30 years. But uh, I do remember the thing about this was, at the time, I was listening to Hank Williams Sr. And, and uh, hear that lonesome whip was, you know. I mean, he's so, the thing about Hank Williams Sr., if y'all haven't listened to him, and I don't anymore, but I did for a long, for a year. But, I mean, it sounds real cheesy and kind of funky, you know, because it has that, you know, and it sounds, but then if you listen to it for a little while, then you start to realize how dead serious he is. I mean, he's such, I, I, I can't explain it, but once you get past <laughs> the kind of funkiness of it, then it's really, it's, it's really strong. But, and I think that was the thing that really started this whole idea. And uh, they used to call hillbillies whippoorwills. It was a euphemism for, for hillbilly. So, anyway. I really appreciate it, y'all. I really do. Thank you very much.